Hey uh, Straw here again. Third video really quick showing you the positioning menu of Sam Screen Archer menu. It's a really nice tool, not just for characters, also for objects. I'll get to that later. You can change position, rotation and scale of any object or character in the game. The first slider step uh, defines the strength of these touch sliders. If you put it really high, then um, you can move uh, the characters really far around really quick. If you set it really small, you can micromanage their position on a very small scale. Yeah, uh, I mean, let's give it a try. Our character is selected. Uh, we use the position X and you can see you can move the character around. We can bump the other character here even though we didn't want to. Oh well. Um, why did we bump our character? Because we have collision on. If we toggle collision off, we can bump all we want. Uh, nothing's gonna happen. Should have done that before. Oh well. You can also change uh, yeah, the position on the z-axis. That however only works when the collision uh, is toggled off. If you toggle the collision on, it'll automatically try to go back on the ground. Uh, now, rotation X and Y doesn't work for characters, so I don't even need to try, but rotation Z obviously works. It rotates the character around, just like when you have X pressed in the posing menu. Scale is what the name says, you can make your character really small and really big. And if you feel like you completely screwed up uh, everything, you can just reset position, rotation and scale or press R to reset everything at the same time. You can uh, toggle game pause also in this menu. Um, you see her eyes are closed and will remain closed because she was just blinking. Most operations in SAM uh, actually require the game to be unpaused, so we're gonna leave it at that. In this menu you can also enable and disable Foot IK. Foot IK uh, is a system where the feet will automatically seek flat ground. Some poses um, are made uh, without Foot IK in mind, like when there's a raised foot that is actually not supposed to stand firm on the ground, uh, then it will actually pull the feet back onto the ground if you enable it. So for posing you actually want to have it disabled. That really makes sense. Alright, so much for the positioning. You can also, as I said, uh, manipulate objects with this and in order to do that, remember we have in the console our character selected, you can just select anything else like this nicely fully arranged vanity table and you see the values are updating and you can also move this around and do whatever you want with it actually also do the whole rotation thing because it's an object and it actually works let's reset all right so much for the positioning menu see you around on the next video and enjoy bye